Well, with the new year approaching, the idea of starting fresh and reaching health goals is probably on a lot of people's minds. If this sounds like you, here are some tips for your New Year's resolution. The holiday season is coming to an end, and if you want to get serious about changing your health habits, <laughs> health experts suggest that you learn how to be consistent. <sighs> so just finding your group with it, or maybe if you don't know exactly what to do, just getting some help from a personal trainer who does know what to do. The first tip to help you see results is to break down your goal into a process. Instead of saying that you'll lose 20 pounds next year, say that you'll work out 20 minutes a day. And don't think that you have to spend countless hours on the treadmill to lose fat. Experts say you really don't even have to run if that's your goal. You really don't have to be. We have some power lifters that are like the most jacked, shredded people I've ever seen on the entire planet. Trainers say lifting weights can burn the same or even more calories than running if your heart rate is up. And the second tip is to make it a habit. If you set a specific time for your workout, say 7 a.m. every day after you brush your teeth, make your bed, and have breakfast, it'll just become part of your routine. Consistency is the key. It has been my dad's saying for as long as I can remember. We used to have it written on the wall. And number three, make it actionable. It's better to show up to the gym for five minutes than not to show up at all. And trainers say that if you're brand new to the gym, take it easy at first. Just trying to get in the gym two to three times a week. If you're a really big beginner, 30 minutes is gonna do plenty. And if your goal is to lose fat, you must take your diet seriously. The main thing, of course, is diet. Uh, we always say put the fork down.